Hey, after Bobby Huggins got fired as the head coach at West Virginia, former Arizona standout Kerr Creasa re-entered the transfer portal. Remember, he left, and of course, Kylan Boswell will take his place at point guard at the UAV. But now he is announcing that he is back and is looking forward to playing for new head coach Josh Eilert and the Mountaineers. Meanwhile, FC Tucson is looking forward to its next matchup at the Kino Sports Complex on Wednesday against Capo FC, especially after a disappointing ending against Ventura County after taking a 2-1 lead in the 89th minute on the goal you just saw. Sadly, Ventura County scored on a penalty kick in the 90th minute to tie things up. Got to get going this week for FC Tucson. Meanwhile, former FC Tucson standout Aaron Long and a Team USA mainstay is proud of this. The North Americans avoided the loss and ended up tying Jamaica 1-1 in their game in the Gold Cup by coming back. That was yesterday and tonight another fan favorite right here in Tucson in the old Pueblo opened up against Honduras. I'm talking about Team Mexico. Let's head to Houston where it was a big pro Mexico crowd on the game broadcast on Fox Sports 1 and it was in English and in the first minutes Luis Romo from Mexico puts the tricolor 1-0 as you saw later Orbelin Pineda is playing absolutely brilliant brilliant and trip out on this or shall I say flip out on this because this game was a rout. Mexico opens up the Gold Cup with a 4-0 victory over Honduras. Mexico will play Haiti next later this week right here in Arizona on Thursday in the Phoenix area while Team USA plays in Charlotte on Sunday against Trinidad and Tobago. That's it for now. I'm Paul Cicala for News 4 Tucson Sports. Let's send it right back over to Eric Fink.